so the budget today uh, has been uh, a very uh, i would say reassuring from the point of view that uh, a lot has been talked about uh, working for the farmer uh, working also for a common man in terms of uh, reducing the taxes so the income taxes have reduced which is going to generate money and uh, that money is going to come back into the economy also uh, i think uh, farmers distress has been very well handled uh, the whether it is the subventions that the government has announced in the event of uh, bad crops or uh, a certain amount of 6000 rupees is going to be delivered in the account of the farmer uh, all these measures in a way uh, generate lot of positivity and generate a good working environment wherein you know the uh, automotive growth has been a little subdued uh, we have been growing if you see all the sectors have been growing pv we have a growth of uh, 4% commercial vehicles are growing at about 20 22% motorcycle growing at 10% so we have had growth i think but what we want all of us is much higher growth and uh, that i think is going to get an impetus with this budget because government is going to uh, put more money in infrastructure uh, in the hands of the farmer so i think the rural penetration is going to improve and definitely uh, the automotive uh, segments that cater to the rural segment will get a flip also uh, we we been wanting ckd and skds uh, duties not to go up uh, which have been not have been touched also in the area of direct taxation uh, we were looking at uh, reduction in terms of uh, the total tax coming down Uh, to about 25 percent, but uh, that has not happened. Uh, automotive companies have lot of investment to do to meet the crash safety norms, to meet the emission norms of BS6, and many more regulatory requirements are coming. So, if we have to continuously invest, uh, we will need.